Hi, we're, we're the Allen family, and I'm Mike, and this is my wife, Kim, and my son, Ezra, Hi. and my daughter, Eldana, and my son, Jude, and Hi. my son, Isaac. Hi. And, uh, you know, we, we started doing these videos actually several years ago uh, just because um, we really like a certain, we're, we're inspired by another group. I'm going to let Ezra tell you a little bit about it. Um, we started these videos because we're, we're all into a, um, a YouTube channel called Dude Perfect, and we thought, hey, don't we try, how about we try a video like that? And so we thought we needed a name, and we didn't think we were as good as Dude Perfect, so we <laughs> kind of like, so we called ourselves Dude Average. <laughs> Set the bar a little lower. <laughs> Perfect. Now, how do you guys come up with the individual tricks? I mean, I know I've only seen the quarantine edition video, and I don't know how you guys come up with even a quarter of those. So, how do you guys come up with those, and what's the who, who's the mastermind? I guess. Um. So our whole family basically comes up. So like, I come up with some. My dad and my mom, my brother, and Aldon and Jude come up with some. So it's a team mm -hmm. effort. It's really fun. You know, we're, it's kind of one of those when you're when you're outside playing. We spend a lot of time outside, and uh, they're just kind of always thinking in terms of like, oh, we could do this, oh, we could do this. So it's not like when we decide to do something, we you know we just like say, okay, let's make a list. We kind of always have a running list of things that would be really fun to try and do. Now I noticed on the video, um, it seems like the whole family gets involved. How do you guys decide? You know, who tries which trick, um, and does it change as you go along? <laughs> you know. Some of them are really funny because like, you know, some of, some of them we do and like, they're just easy, like whoever kind of has the idea, we kind of let that one roll. And sometimes when we know that uh, we've had like somebody's kind of on an idea generation role, then we're just kind of look and see at whose age are they most likely to accomplish the stuff. Um, and, and, you know, you'd be surprised. Some of them are literally like first, second take, and then you just move on. But like things where we're trying to throw the ball across the street take like 45 minutes and a lot of ice packs on your shoulders, uh, you know, a little later on in the evening and the following days. Um, but it's, um, yeah, it, it's, I think it's surprise, it would surprise people how fast you can kind of generate some of these things when you have, uh, when you have ideas that are fun to try and accomplish. Now, that's my next question is some of those look really, really tricky. Um, for the really hard ones, how long, like, I guess, like, what's the longest it's ever taken to nail one of these tricks? Um, gosh, probably, probably 45 minutes or an hour. I mean, and there's, I got to tell you, there's ones that we've never gotten to do, you know, but there's also ones that's funny, like when, you know, Isaac, there's one where he's standing in a tree house in our backyard and he throws the basketball and I mean, that was like fourth take, you know, <laughs> I mean, it's just like, sometimes they just happen, but the real, the ones, the ones that take a long time that you end up doing it for 20 minutes and then you stop and like, okay, we'll just try it again later. We'll do something else. You come back and do it again. And, and then eventually all you need is one. All you need is one. <laughs> and then you've got to act like you've been there before. You know, that's the hardest part. And it's really patience building for our kids. <laughs> so we we're, we're liking the character building. That's great. Um, and I guess that's one of my last questions is, what do you guys get out of it? I mean, people watching the video obviously get a lot of entertainment, um, but I guess what's in it for you guys? What keeps you, you know, what makes you keep doing these videos? Mm -hmm. What do you think, Kim? Yeah? I don't know, what do you think, Eldana? Why do we do these videos? Because they're what? Awesome. Oh, they're awesome. <laughs> they're awesome for us, you know, but also it's just kind of one of those things where we are a family that believes that, uh, that you know, the, the most exciting things are like in the everyday stuff, you know, you, you don't, you don't need electronics, you don't need people to try and create fun for you, you go create it, you know, and the things that make you as a family smile are the things that we found make other people smile too. So it's been, um, you know, we've been doing this for a couple of years, we, we do music parody videos sometimes. Uh, I, I work for a school that we do a lot of announcement videos through a bunch of fun stuff. So We've just found that people often need the smile. And so we are happy to be able to find a way to provide. Yeah, and especially right now when we're all home, you know, right now looking for like that thing that everyone in the family loves to do. Um, this has just really been a big joy giver for us. And we hope that um, it brings smiles to others too.